Are you looking for a great set of explorer figures to make a school diorama project? Or do you just want to learn about history through model kits? Well, if so, stay tuned as we open up the lid on this great Lewis and Clark box from IMAX. Coming up next on Monster Hobbies, what's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Hello everybody, welcome back down to another awesome unboxing kit. My name is Trevor Ursulescu and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. So today we are going to be looking at the IMAX kit of Lois and Clark, the Expedition. This is a 172nd scale kit. It is not a military kit per se, but it does have a lot of cool things that you could use in your other 172nd scale models, as well as it makes a great diorama for school projects and helps you learn about history. So without further ado, let's go down to the bench and see what's in the box. The Lewis and Clark Expedition was the first American expedition to cross the western portion of the United States. In 1803, President Thomas Jefferson commissioned the expedition to explore and map the newly acquired territory, to find a practical way across the western part of the continent, and to establish American presence in this territory before Britain and Europe could do so. The expedition was also scientific and economic. They studied the area's plants, animal life, geography, and established trade with local First Nation tribes. The expedition returned to St. Louis with maps, sketches, and journals in hand. And now let's take a look at the contents of the box. And to start with, we have a nice painting here of the expedition itself with Lewis and Clark and Sacagawea as their Indian guide. And as we look at the box here, we see that it comes with 18 figures in assorted poses, two teepees, two Indian canoes, one wooden raft with provisions, two horses, two pack ponies, a log canoe, a campfire, and a drying hide rack. A lot of these items come in other IMAX fi figure kits. On the back of the box, we also have the paints you need to paint up these nice models in the way that they are. They show Humbro paints here, but you can also use acrylic paints like the Citadel Games Workshop paints. Clean up nicely with water and brushes. So now let's take a look at the pieces inside the box. The first models in this set are the teepees. I must confess that they are not assembled in the box. I was going to build my example of this kit for a store display. The box available online and in our store is untouched, so don't worry. But note the realism in how the fabric hangs off the poles. These models come in two pieces and they glue together easily with testers liquid cement. Next up is our two canoes. These nicely detailed boats come with rippled water detail molded to their bottoms. These are the two horses. Each horse is in a different pose but carry the correct supplies. These are the two pack ponies. They are molded as a single unit and include the full set of packs for the journey. Here is the log canoe and the wooden raft. The bottom of the supplies are notched to fit the wooden raft. This is what the raft looks like with the provisions set in place. Next up is a campfire and drying rack. Note the detail of the ropes on the drying rack. The expedition hired many men and those men met up with many of the First Nation tribes. Note the detail on this trapper's clothing. These are the men riding the horses, paddling the canoe and riding the rafts one of the trappers, and one of the Sioux. Here are the leaders of the expedition party, William Clark, Meriwether Lewis, and Sacagawea, their guide. I am not sure who the man is with the rifle on his shoulder. If you think you know, please leave a comment in the description below. Well, I hope you really enjoyed this review of the Lois and Clark kit from IMAX. And if you want one, don't worry. They are available currently at Monster Hobbies. You can get them by coming down to our store, Unit 42B, 11th Avenue Southeast in High River, Alberta, Canada. Or you can check us out online, because everything is online, every single thing. <laughs> www.monster-hobbies.ca And say, while you're doing that, we would appreciate it if you joined our Patreon account so that I can continue making these great videos and thanking you for your patronage ship. And you can check out our Patreon page by following this little bouncing window, it shows our Patreon. And I'll leave the link below in the description as well. And until next time, I really hope you get some good success out of watching these videos and getting these models. Make sure you get an A in your school work. 
And until next time, everybody, happy model building.